Hello friend, today we discuss the inverted YouTube manometer or what we can call an inverted differential manometer which is also for measuring pressure differences at two different points and uh, it is an inverted one. The question says the figure below shows an inverted differential manometer having an oil of specific gravity 0 0.8 connected to two different pipes carrying water under pressure determine the pressure in the pipe B if the pressure in the pipe A is 2.05 meters of water the diagram of the inverted manometer is given as follows this is a lighter liquid which is oil of specific gravity of 0 0.8 in the two pipes A and B there is water flowing one in A is of pressure HA uh, equivalent to 2.0 meters of water and the, this one in B the pressure in B is not known and it's the one which is required uh, let us look at this information here which is given let us assume this is uh, h1 which is equal to that uh, then um, for the fluid in the manometer if it is oil let us call it h and this one from here to here to the center of pipe of B let it be H2 in that regard we want to determine pressure in the right below the datum but below datum XX now using uh, determining pressures in terms of heads in the right there is b so below the datum xx uh, the pressures in the right will be um, pxx in the right pressure in the right will equal to hb minus because it is now below the datum we shall take a minus please it is a minus H times S minus H2 times S2. We know these values, we know these ones, but we don't know HB. So let us continue on substituting the information that we have. This is equal to <coughs> HB minus HS. HS is 150 over a thousand meters times S, which is times 0 0.8, then minus H2, which is. 100 millimeters divided by a thousand to convert it to meters times the specific gravity of the fluid which is in the pipe and it is water since it is water its specific gravity is one this would give you hb minus let us use a calculator 150 times 0.8 then uh, that is a negative uh, plus a 100 0 0.22 that one let us call it equation one so when we consider pressure below the datum xx in the left so pxx in the left will equal to let us consider 
uh, below the letter xx in the left limb it will be ha because that is the pressure in the, the pipe a then minus because it is below the datum xx it will be ha minus h1 s1 these values we know them this is 2 minus h1 we know it as 300 over a thousand times the specific gravity of uh, the fluid in a which is one this is 2 minus 0 0.3 and this will give you 1.7 this is equation 2 so from 1 and 2 these pressures these pressures are equal the pressures the pressures at the same level at the same level in a homogeneous in a continuous homogeneous fluid homogeneous homogeneous fluid are equal so if they are equal it means that um, it means HB minus 0 0.22 will equal to 1.7 so HB will therefore equal to 1.7 plus 0 0.22 HB which is the pressure head in the pipe B will equal to um, 1.92 meters so this is the pressure head in B in terms of head of water <coughs> so this pressure this pressure therefore uh, pressure in B will equal to from hydrostatic slow H low G so it will be H density of B times acceleration due to gravity which will be 1.92 times a thousand which is the density of the liquid which is water times 9.81 so 1.92 times 9.81 kilonewton per cubic meter gives 18.835 kilopascals. So pressure in B is equal to 18.84 kilopascals. I've given it to this process.